I should probably be doing something more productive. Maybe catching up on the Kardashians. This is Central Adirondacks near Stillwater Reservoir. And uh, I'm camped right in the side of just the most gorgeous river. And it's just me and the chipmunks up here, you know. I thought I would uh, try my hand at making music and uh, I just saw a video by Average Alice and uh, she, she just got a ukulele. She's better than I am. I'm terrible. And uh, I thought, uh, well, you know, let's bring it out on the road. Oh, I went to this music store and this, uh, this grunge rocker was the salesman. I mean, you know, we're like, I'm Mr. Computer IT guy and he's like, you know, uh, he's on a different planet. Uh, he said he knew four chords on a ukulele and they had 20 ukuleles there, 20, maybe 25, maybe 30, you know, and a whole wall of them. And I made this guy, we got along pretty good, you know, you got to get a rapport going. But I got this guy for this cheesy purchase that I was making. I got him to play his four chords on every ukulele and we started dividing them into what I liked. And then, uh, you know, we do that. And, uh, you know, we ended up with like five ukuleles I liked. And, uh, and then I made him play them again. And I started winnowing it down, taking them out, taking them out. And I ended up with this guy, this Cordoba ukulele, right? It's a tenor ukulele. And, you know, they had these Fender ones, you know, with, uh, look like a Fender guitar or something with these, you know, the Fender tuning knobs, you know, all in a line, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, it sounded terrible. And they had these highly lacquered ones that were gorgeous. You know, this is like dating. You know, you get something that looks really good, but it turns out it's an empty uh, bubble there, you know. So, you know, like the sound is what sold me. The sound just agreed with me. Once I got it, I, uh, I had to, uh, let me see if I get more light in here. Uh, once I got it, I had to, uh, started following ukulele stuff you know I got really into it and uh, the strings the strings are like everything these guys are making all this stuff about the strings you know these uh, bloggers and you got to learn how to tie these knots when you change the strings and uh, and the inlays and all this to make all this uh, cosmetic baloney um, so I got this thing and I change the strings and the strings <laughs> they take three months to stretch every day I had to tune it but uh, it worked out quite nice. This is a, a Cordoba 20TM-CE. And uh, it's made by hand. And uh, once I got a tune though, once the string stretched, hardly needs to be tuned at all now. Maybe just a touch up before you play. And uh, I still can't play, you know? Uh, so I go on YouTube and I get uh, videos. There's a lot of free videos on there. You can learn how to play a ukulele or almost any instrument on YouTube. And, uh, you know, I learned a couple of chords. Looking for a little instrument to fool around with. You know, it's either this or a harmonica in a teardrop trailer. I didn't have the room for a guitar. Uh, and this is like guitar light. Easy to learn. Fun to play with. And uh, I just wanted to thank Alice for, uh, for reminding me how much fun my ukulele is.